Okay, so this is all in plain to that. And then when you get to the copper tone, Moorish American Americans over here in the West, what you get is more with the root chakra in its lowest form because that is black, red, and brown. The root chakra. And those are describing your so called blacks who are copper toned, brown hue Moors living here in the West in occupied territories right now for a momentarily temporal time span that is collapsing and it's already happened that we've won that we've already went beyond this loop this nexus this connection point between dimensions and we already won we've already went beyond the loop the time space portal and we already won because we are kingdom come and this is another time when the whole system collapsed because even during the mind prophecy or prophecy they talk about between 1618 and 2012 will be the highest of the material or materialism it will be the highest desire for that uh, willpower to be used okay so this is what we're talking about man it gets deep into the hells and bounds of north america and as you already know is we're living in the age of aquarius which what does that mean aquarius the water barrier the sign of astrology that's the sign of astrology that's the sign of science sign of globalism okay aquarius right that rules west by north so what you get northwest aquarius rules the northwest north gate here in north america and that's the age of enlightenment as they say that's the new age the age of aquarius and who's the host who's the barrier Northwest, Northwest Amexo, North America, or North Africa, whichever you want to label it. Okay. So again, man, this, we're dealing with the end times, the end points, the prophecies has already been there in your face. We can go in with uh, native, so-called native prophecy, right? So-called native prophecy, and you can research this yourself. It's called the Black Eagle prophecy the book of stars right that prophecy and read that because it's talk about hopi back to the hopi who has the prophecies of the end times about your lands or the lands that you're living on right now that you call america it has the prophecies and what will happen and it's already written because again again david ford l as you know as master farad muhammad right he his quote was your history talking about uh the asiatic black man here known as moorish american american or negro he his history is in the stars and if your history is in the stars then guess what your future is in the stars as well right and who are the best time keepers who are the best time calculators it will be your called it will be your so-called minds and your so-called uh people or moorish people across the world because even you will find prophecies in tibet talking about north america in tibet they they already prophesize about a coming like a man like malachi is york in 19 who will come in 1945 in june 26 they already prophesied tibetan prophecies okay they already said that and that happened right but now you'll find history or prophecies such as the black eagle prophecy and the hope you receive that from dogon who are malian moors and those are kemet that's kemet because that's dealing with tamare okay down in the continental of africa that we know as today tamare kemet mali timbuktu all those are uh extension of us 
in ancient times they used to come over here they're they're our brothers you know 